to know what's inside a hockey stick? Well, many people have. Today we see all kinds of hockey sticks made from just about every incredible type of fibre you can imagine. Carbon fibre and every other thing. Even we've seen in the modern uh, factories these massive giant spider's web type of things weaving carbon fibre into this something that turns out to be a hockey stick. And we have all these fandangled names that tell us about the hitting zone and the power and the striking and everything else. So I decided Let's cut a few hockey sticks up and see exactly what's inside a hockey stick. So, I've got a couple of um, current day sticks here, reasonably modern. I'm not going to cut up a brand new stick, of course. Um, this one is a Dita Terra V6. And it says here, Outdoor Senior Composite. Power Index 10.6. See what I mean? Full Composite. I've stripped away the, uh, the binding on the handle so we can have a look underneath and we can compare which sticks are which. And um, when I strip that away down the bottom here, I, I see an interesting little label and this shows me that this stick was made in 2007 in China. And there it is. So if you pull off your strapping on your handle, you may well find out a little bit more detail about the stick. The other stick I have here is a, a TK. And this tells me it's carbon fibre, xylon, and aramid to a small percent. Information panel here, which tells us it's a composite titan, uh, the weight, how to read it, and it says it was made in 2007, uh, but it doesn't tell us where it was made. So, that's a little bit of information on those two. They're, um, both different shapes, uh, different bowls, slightly different heads. Uh, I've had a hit with both sticks, and the power is reasonably similar, and uh, touch probably a little bit better with the TK, uh, in my opinion, than the Dita. But that's probably just down to personal preference as much as anything else. So uh, let's get to it. Here we go. shaft. Oh, that's the end of the TK.